Hey everyone and welcome back to The Breakdown. Today I'm going to be teaching you how to download and install texture packs slash resource packs in Minecraft 1.18.1. And guess what? Texture packs and resource packs are the exact same thing for 1.18.1. So you'll hear me use those words interchangeably. I mean texture packs, I mean resource packs, whichever one you're kind of looking for is what I mean because they're the exact same thing. I can't stress that enough. First and most though, we do have a smart sponsor, which is Apex Minecraft. So you can go to the first link down below, the breakdown.xyz slash Apex to start your very own 24-hour DDoS protected Minecraft server. We actually own just Apex so much that we have our own server, played our breakdowncraft.com on them. So if you want to start your own server, whether it's modded, whether it's not modded, whether it's vanilla, whether it's got plugins on it, whether it doesn't, it's up to you. And it can be done through Apex Minecraft hosting. That's the first link down below, the breakdown.xyz slash Apex. Nevertheless, let's go ahead and and get some texture packs installed. The first thing we want to do is download some. And you can find at the second link down below a list of 15 awesome resource packs that all work for Minecraft 1.18. In this video, we're going to install a few here. We're going to install, first and foremost, Sfax Pure BD Crafts. So we're going to go ahead, right click on these download buttons and open them. You can also just click on them. That's fine. But we're going to be downloading multiple ones. So we're going to open them in a new tab. We're going to grab Majestica here. And then last but not least, we're going to be grabbing LB Photorealism. This one has something special about it that I want to show you that's specific to, you know, like 1.18 packs. It's kind of interesting. Anyway, once we're here, let's go ahead and get going. First off, we need to download Sfax Pure BD Craft, which takes us to our website. We can click on the download button there to be taken to their official download page. Once you're here, we want to make sure MC 1.18 is selected, and then we want to select which uh, version we want. It's crazy how much more clarity you get from the different uh, versions there. We'll go ahead for uh, kind of right here in the middle at 128. Click on download 128 there. You're going to get this link. We want to download with an ad and we want to then accept their terms of use. After 15 seconds, this download will begin, but luckily you don't have to wait that. Only I do. So our waiting has finished and we can click the blue download button for Pure Spax Pure BD Craft to start downloading. Now, one thing I will say is you may have to keep or save these files. We won't have to. Google Chrome doesn't require you to keep texture pack files. However, most of Firefox, I believe, does. Majestica is the next one we're downloading. Once you're here, go ahead and click on the download button. By the way, I'm showing you three different ways you might have to download these packs, just, just so you know. And once we're here, we want to click on this blue download button on the right hand side under Majestica 1.18. When we click that download button, we did get a pop up there, but that's okay. We can see in the bottom left, Majestica 1.18 is downloading, so we're good to go. Next up is LPU of Photorealism. And once we're here, we want to come over here to the right hand side and scroll down. The reason I said this one was unique is because of this. Minecraft 1.17 resource packs will work in Minecraft 1.18. They'll say they like they'll have a red compatibility warning, but they will work because no new textures were added between Minecraft 1.17 and Minecraft 1.18. So keep that in mind. Nevertheless, let's go ahead and click on the orange download button next to the 1.17 version. And after a few seconds, it will begin downloading. Once we've got these downloaded, I recommend moving them to your desktop just for ease of use because we will need to add them to another folder later. Having them all together is easier. So nevertheless, to do that, we want to go ahead and click the little Windows icon to the top left of my screen. It's probably in the bottom of your screen, but if you're on Windows 11, it's in the center of your screen. Go ahead and click on that little Windows icon and then type in Downloads. You have this Downloads file folder here, and in here you will find LPB Folder Realism, Majestica, Pure Media Craft, or any resource pack you want to install. By the way, they're all installed the exact same way. As long as they're for 1.17 or higher, you'll be able to install them in 1.18 without any issues. Now let's go ahead and drag and drop these to your desktop just for ease of use. Like I said, we're going to be moving them again later on. Now let's go ahead and open up Minecraft 1.18.1 here. So here we are, a Minecraft launcher. Wait for it. 1.18.1 will be selected. Come on. That took longer than I expected to load. Here we are, 1.18 latest release selected. Click play and I won't make you sit through way opening up Minecraft the entire way. So I'll just go ahead and meet you on the Minecraft main menu. Here we are on the Minecraft main menu where we can now go ahead and click on options and resource packs. Again, that's from the Minecraft main menu. Click on options and resource packs, and then we can click on open pack folder in the bottom center of the screen. Then we want to take and drag and drop any resource packs we want to install into this folder. Once we've done that, we come back, they are all here. We have LPB photo or LBPR photo realism. We also have Majestica and we also have pure BD craft. As I said, 1.17 packs will have this red warning. We'll show you how to bypass that, but first let's show you how to install 1.18 pack. To do that, you simply want to hover over it and click the little play button that appears. Click on that. It's going to move it to selected. When you do that, click done. It's going to reload Minecraft and your resource pack will be installed. What's great is we can go ahead and jump in game and switch resource packs. So jump into multiplayer. We're going to go into play.breakdowncraft.com, the best survival and skyblock server in the multiverse. 1.18. Come play with this. You'll love it. Nevertheless, once we've loaded in here, we can see that this resource pack is in fact installed. We are good to go. However, 
However, what if you want to change your resource pack? Well, to do that, you want to go ahead and hit Escape, click on Options and Resource Packs, and you can do this in any game in any world. And we want to go ahead and click the basically icon there to move this back over. And then let's install this 117 pack. When we click on that, it's going to give us this warning. Go ahead and click Yes. You know what you're doing. You're fine. And then go ahead and click Done. Now, Minecraft is going to reload, and LPVR Photorealism will be installed. It's that simple. As you can see, new resource pack installed. Looking good. Looking good. Wow, it actually amazes me how realistic <laughs> this resource pack looks. But last but not least, we want to go ahead and go into options and resource packs, and we can move over Majestica. Now, how we've done this is we've clicked that little arrow, move Majestica over top of LPBR Photorealism. Now, Majestica has all the 1.18 textures in it, but let's say it didn't. If it didn't have a texture, let's say grass, grass would then default back to LPBR Photorealism. So if you do have an older pack and you install it over a 1.18 pack, a lot of times, that will allow those textures to shine through. Specifically though, if let's say you have a weapons pack, you might want to install a weapons pack and still have another resource pack under it. In that case, you would put the weapons pack on top and then under that you would put another resource pack and then you'd be good to go. We can now click done though and Majestica will reload. Again, I don't have any way to show you that uh, LPBR photorealism is in here because well, it simply Majestica has textures for everything. But now that is Majestica installed. It's that simple and that easy. And that is how you can download and install resource packs in Minecraft 1.18.1. Again, this is the same as texture packs. It's exactly the same for both Minecraft versions. And if you ever do want to install them, it is as simple as coming over here and uninstalling everything, moving everything from selected to available, and now it is done. You're good to go. You can also even hot install resource packs in game, by the way. So if you're in game, you can go to options, resource packs, and drag and drop a pack in here and it will work. For example, if we delete Majestica, all right, we can just delete it and it's gone from the game, right? It's not there anymore. It's that simple. Install Pure BD Craft and we're good to go. Speaking of good to go, come play this on the best Minecraft server in the multiverse. Play.breakdowncraft.com are currently on our Skyblock server. We have amazing 1.18 survival as well, though. Medieval survival, aquatic survival, you will love it. Play.breakdowncraft.com is the IP. I cannot wait to see you online. Be sure to subscribe to the channel for more incredible Minecraft content every single day of the week. Truly, we post every day. And most days, recently, we've been posting multiple videos a day as we are doing content for 1.18 and 1.18.1. This is, in my opinion, the biggest Minecraft release we have ever had. I absolutely love the new biomes, love all the new stuff, and I want to help you all play it because it's absolutely incredible. Nevertheless, my name is Nick. This has been The Breakdown. Check out Apex. Check out Breakdown Craft. I will see you in the next video. I'm out. Peace.